But are you hungry? I'm always hungry, you know, because it's 640 on Wednesday, which means it's time for bucket list for the final week of our Cajun list. Heather Baker and I head to the Faded Rose. Check it out. Okay, Heather, it's time for week four of the Cajun Bucket List on our final stop. And we could not end this month without the Faded Rose. So if you haven't seen our whole list, grab the AY Magazine, look at the whole list, because it is time to eat some yummy food. We're going to take you inside. Hi, I'm Zach David with the Faded Rose, and I'm going to tell you a little bit about what we're sending out today. We're going to be sending out our black and red fish poncho train. It's a piece of black and red fish with our crab meat, mushroom, and red pepper sauce on it. Uh, we're sending out our blackened ribeye. It's a bone-in ribeye, blackened on, on the grill uh, with our lemon butter sauce. We've got a, our crawfish etouffee. Last but not least, we'll be sending out our shrimp and grits and our gumbo. Our shrimp and grits is a, a couple fried grit cakes with our uh, andouille cream sauce and some uh, large shrimp on it. Our gumbo is a uh, dark roux gumbo with uh, okra, shrimp, and andouille sausage. Now that you know what's on the menu, let's get it put together and sent out to Heather and Hillary. So I'm definitely going to start off with this crawfish etouffee because crawfish is one of my favorite things. I mean, I know you're going in for that steak, girl. Oh, yeah, because this is blackened mm -hmm. and Boy, the seasoning on it, it's just a, two of my favorite here at Fader Rose. I mean, Josh, you have to get a tight shot of this gumbo. It is loaded with andouille sausage, shrimp, and it is so rich and hearty. Wait, you just said shrimp, and I'm distracted by the shrimp in front of you right now. What is that? Oh, other? girl, there's the Cajun food right there. That's shrimp and grits, and it is so good. And that's one of my favorites. Yeah, say you want something light. Their soak mm -hmm. salad is awesome. Get the blackened chicken on it. You'll never go back. It's so good. Well, Heather, if you want to talk about presentation, oh, it is right here with the Red Snapper Concentrate. This thing's beautiful, but what you got in your hand over there? Well, I'm not into cracking this crab. This is my friend Crab Bean. I already stuck a bite of it. I have never had soft shell crab before, and crab is my thing, but this is so good. What? All right, we are wrapping up Cajun Month, and this food was spectacular. But we can't end it without some dessert and a drink. So, you know, bread pudding is calling somebody's name. It's my favorite. Woo woo! All right, so I'm going to drink up on my hurricane. What are you drinking? I got a there? French 75 because I'm fancy, but I got to set this down for a second because you know me. I, oh, just. <laughs> right, you got to get some of that bread pudding, but you better tune in next week to see because we have an all new month and it's all breakfast on AY's bucket list. Bye bye. I've had so much bread pudding after the Cajun bucket list that I think I've gained 15 it pounds. It just sounds so I'm not complaining, good. though, because it's good. It's good.